the travel vlogs the travel vlogs are back <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabrielle. If it's your first time here, it's currently Tuesday. I am traveling in two days. So I am going on vacation. Your girl's going on a vacances. It's actually really appropriate that I say it in French. So I'm taking a little trip. I think I specifically scheduled everything that I needed to do travel-wise for tomorrow because I did not want to be running around like a headless chicken on Thursday. This afternoon. Oh my god, everything's making noise right now. Why? Today, this morning, I actually filled out the travel form, a pre-travel immigration form that you have to fill out. I'm really excited for this trip. The travel vlogs. The travel vlogs are back, babes. <laughs> anyway, guys, I will catch up with you all later in the week. I just got my PCR test done. First of all, it was so much better than the last time because they only did one nostril. I think it's really important I say this so that nobody else ends up like me. Unlike last year when you guys saw me leave, every single thing is by appointment. Obviously, I was looking at the protocols of the countries that I'm going to, so I never got that information. All that being said, you have to book an appointment to get a PCR test. And apparently you need to book it like days in advance, probably a week in advance or whatever. You need to book it long in advance because they fill up like for several days or whatever. To the health center, come to the gardens. You need your passport and you need, if you're vaccinated, you need your um, vaccination card as well. Do not press your luck with it. Get an appointment if you, yeah, if you're traveling. Just get an appointment to do the PCR, do the right way. Um, same hundred dollars. Anyway, I have to collect my results tomorrow. Thursday currently sorry my eyes feeling a little bit irritated I just got my hair done I do my hair by Mag Madalena Dominican hairdresser across from social security I've literally been going to her from year for years so I decided to just blow up my hair and it just looks so thick and healthy and great would have shown you guys when my phone died is always dying but I can't wait to have my camera soon I have not gotten my results yet from my test apparently they needed to redo the entire batch so hopefully we should have it like sent to us digitally later tonight right now i'm just going to properly pack up my stuff though anyway i'm gonna go do that and i'll keep y'all updated hey guys hello from me and the little bro just gonna head to the airport's little well i'm driving myself but little bro is technically <laughs> dropping me off and it's going to really start the the adventures the adventures of gabrielle just look out for it you know this is today's fit gray sweatpants gray top you know we gotta layer up because the final destination that i'm getting to is a little bit it's a little bit cold ah! <laughs> it's a little bit cold yeah <laughs> but anyway guys talk to you later
so basically Barbados has a whole system and they give you like a wristband depending on what it is that you are your what you're doing in Barbados whether you're vaccinated or not so mine is yellow it's like this because I'm in transit yes I put on the N95, the big boy. So now, yeah. that immigration line for like a whole hour just to go through in like 10 seconds hey y'all i just got through immigration and all that at Heathrow airport so i'm gonna take the tube and get to my cousins it's a little bit intimidating because i haven't taken the tube in like three or four years so yeah we're gonna see what's happening so it's 11 degrees but I feel like I'm prepared for it because it's actually not as cold as I was expecting. Then again, I am wearing four layers. <laughs> Did y'all hear that? So I am finally in London! And we're all excited and everything. I just got here. I'm sitting on the ground, yes, because you know, ew, I'm still in these clothes. I'm about to go take a shower and all that jazz. But I just want to say I finally arrived. So your girl actually still remembers to take the train and all that. Honestly, I feel like London has the best transit system. And I've been to a few different countries and experienced a few different transit systems. I feel like New Zealand comes close too, but London for me is the best one. I didn't get lost. It was a struggle one or two times when I had to go up platforms and go down like tons of steps with my bags, but it's okay. Anyway, I'm going to do like a full skincare routine now, shower, get cute, and then later we're going to go out and do other things. But this is just going to be like the intro of my London travels and all of that. So I'm going to end this vlog right here. Stay tuned to the next one. Bye! <laughs>